introduction the terms widely used in pn series of no pockets free joining slope gravity flow in this lesson we will see the meanings and requirements for a no pockets free joining slope and gravity flow in the piping system design no pocket the term no pocket means no liquid pocket in the line when it's necessary to prevent vapor pockets the note will read no vapor pockets for no pocket lines elevation changes or either vertically up or vertically down but not both refer the figure is a source is going to vertically up to the destination flow in this image source is a source is a destination flow coming vertically down a section of the pipe that will not self drain due to pipe layout orientation is considered a pipe packet this is a packet it is a uh, it is available in the piping <coughs> why do pockets appear during piping layout pipes may encounter many obstructions such as structure equipment or the piping etc and may need to change elevation valve accessibility and expansion loop typical applications of no pocket two phase lines compressor section line column overhead vapor lines vapor balancing lines extras example of no pocket lines the column overhead vapor lines going to the overhead canals should not have a liquid pocket this is the minimum requirement if the column overhead vapors carries entrained liquid it may accumulate in this liquid pocket and prevent the free vapor flow by fudging the flow path this liquid accumulation may not be apparent until absorbed reading product quality deviation etc agar so rather than depending upon signal and low point draining piping can be routed in such a way that prevents any liquid accumulation that's why we indicate no pocket for the column overhead vapor line in pngd for a two phase flow line process engineers typically indicate a node provide support for two phase flow typically they try to minimize the sludge flow in the two phase flow because that can lead to serious preserve fluctuation and vibration a two phase flow line should not have a pocket because liquid will accumulate and promote unstable flow the pump suction line should not have any high point vapor pocket however this is a typically not specified on pndd free draining the term free draining means elevation changes or downward only for the unwanted liquid to the drain out from the line process motive fluid may have different flow direction no pockets no liquid and gas pockets in the line are permitted a free draining line may or may not be sloped refer the figure source to destination for example psp net lines typical application psp inlet outlet line deadlock compressor suction line should be free draining towards suction knockout drum compressor pipe line etc example of free draining lines the relief valve inlet line shall be free draining towards the protected equipment or pipe header while it's installed relieving fluid flow goes upward and relief through psv but any liquid at this line will be free draining towards protecting equipment to ensure no liquid accumulation that can hinder relief operation 
A line have two sections free draining to either side as shown in figure. Compressor section pipe should be free draining towards section of drum or low point in the section line. Slope The slope indicates a change in the elevation of the line. In general, slope indicates elevation changes that are constantly downward. Slope recommends or specifically mentioned in the PNDD easing symbol. Typically, a minimum one is trying the slope is required for a flat main girder and one is two is required for flat sub girders. Typical application of slope. Typically, the following lines are provided with slope. Flat main girder, flat sub girder, joint girder, Strong water channel extras. Gravity flow. Gravity flow means that the elevation downstream never exceed in that elevation. <coughs> the line may contain pockets. In this symbol for gravity flow. In PNDD, the gravity flow recommend is represented by using a symbol to the flood free draining recommend this means and also the term gravity flow is mentioned above the arrow typical application of gravity flow sometimes we have a straight design in such a way that column will be at the bottom section exchange reflex tendency will be at the top and the reflex term is in between the column and exchange for those configurations, typically we don't use the pump for reflux going to the to a column. We are making sure that the reflux will flow by gravity to the drum because of the elevation difference. And from the drum, it flows to the column using gravity. There we typically indicate gravity flow because of the elevation difference between suits and destination. Process flow flow by gravity. There we are not using any pump. The gravity flow line is not the same as free draining. Free draining is typically for cleaning lines purposes, whereas gravity flow direction of process motive fluid has the same direction because because of elevation difference. Following table shows the definition and some of the common application of the above mentioned piping requirements. However, in order to specify the correct recommend different parameters such as equipment type, fluid phase, compression and nature, the piping material and finally project specification as well as client recommend should be taken into account. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share with your friends and colleagues.